Can you please explain to us gardeners about these awful tomato hornworms? <laughs> How and when do they come to be on our tomato plants? Do hornworms come out of the soil or are they from eggs laid by a large moth? And this is Miss Hazel in Eads. It's actually a good question though. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I mean, yeah. do they come out of the soil or from eggs that are laid by right. large moths? Yes. Yes. They do come they do. from the moths. The hawk moth or it's called and, a sphinx moth puked. or hummingbird moth. And they pupate in the soil. So uh, it's the uh, sphinx moth. Yeah. They're sometimes Swamp. called hummingbird moth. Yeah. It's a sphinx moth. It's a, it's a real pretty moth. The moth will lay, the lay an egg on a tomato plant mm -hmm. and it'll hatch and it'll be a little bitty hornworm and it mm -hmm. gets bigger as the more it eats. The, and you can, you, you can find them by looking for the droppings. Right, right. It's the easiest way to find them because they're so well camouflaged yeah. on a tomato plant. It, yeah. you know, look you, for the bare you, stems. That's the bare stems. That's yeah, where they've been. Yeah. You know, that's yeah. where they've, they've been. been. They yeah. will but, uh, about to uh, a tomato. Sure will. Fortunately, uh, a real good product to control them is BT. Bacillus yes. thuringiensis does a real good job of controlling them. And you, there's no waiting period. And it's not harmful to humans. It's not harmful to beneficial insects. And uh, you can put that out there and they'll take care of them. But uh, they are from a month. And after they finish, like this old boy right here yeah. uh, that we got on the table, right. he's about done. You know, he's about as big as he's going to get. So he'll He'll crawl off in the ground, fall down in the ground, and and and, and he'll pupate. Okay. And and then next spring. It'll be next spring. Uh, this when uh, and I don't know whether they go in the moth. Yeah. Come, come out as a moth. And, okay. And, and here again are the dropping. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Kinda little worms have little droppings. droppings. Big worms have big droppings. Yes, it's <laughs> a big dropping. There's no doubt about that. And that one is, by the way, a tobacco hornworm. The tomato hornworms have a V on them. I mean, okay. You can tell the difference. They, the V is a, wow, I could have had a V8. Just remember that for tomatoes. <laughs> that one has just slashes on yeah. the side, so that's a tobacco hornworm. Mm. It doesn't have the V. It's okay. got the slashes. Mm.